Right, good morning everybody, my name is Paul, I'm also called Knickknack. I am the brains behind Knickknack's Old Peculiar, the world's most incredibly repetitive blog, and behind Knickknack's Daily Teaser. It's a fun series of brain teaser quizzes. You can find them on my blog, or here on my YouTube channel, Mr. Cuddy 2977 Please, while you're on YouTube, feel free to hit that button there, that will take you to some more of my content, but please feel free to hit like, share, subscribe, and ding the notification bell. That way, when I release today's answers in tomorrow's quiz, you get to hear about them first. Let's get a move on, shall we? Right, with that lot said and done, it's the 1st of November, it's 2023, and it's very much a non-leap year. So, you know. Here's five questions about 1st of November. Question 1. In a non-leap year, 1st of November is the 305th day of the year. Is 305 a prime number? Question 2. Lennox Gastaut Syndrome Awareness Day, and I hope I've pronounced that lot right, is on the 1st of November. The condition is a rare form of childhood onset what? Dementia, epilepsy or leprosy? 3. 1st of November is World Vegan Day. Veganism is a form of what? Vegetarianism, abstinence from alcohol, or choral singing? 4. 1st of November is National Brush Day in the USA. What are you supposed to be brushing? Your hair, your teeth, or your carpet? Finally, question 5. 1st of November 1898 saw the birth of singer Sippy Wallace. She was known as the Texas... What? That's today's questions for the 1st of November. Yesterday's Nevadan themed answers. I thought a change would do me good rather than just have a Halloween set. I had a set about Nevada. Those ten answers are 1. 1864 2. The Silver State 3. Carson City 4. Las Vegas 5. Carson City again 6. Prostitution but only in a licensed brothel in a county that's voted in favour of it 7. California and if I've understood it correctly the place was built with the bars in the Californian side and the casino in the Nevada bit. At the time it was built, California is supposed to have had very liberal uh, licensing drinking hours, but had criminalized gambling, and Nevada had comparatively harsh drinking laws, but legalized gambling and prostitution. What the hey? Eight hotel rooms, nine ghost towns, ten. Nuclear weapons. Right, thank you for watching that little lot. I hope they both puzzled you and were enjoyable. I also hope you'd like to have a go at today's teaser quiz. If you do, remember you need to put your answers on today's daily teaser post on the blog on Knickknacks Old Peculiar by 7am tomorrow UK time. If you're on YouTube, you will find the link to the post in the info box under this video, in the little eye in the corner, and floating past on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Today's post will go live by approximately 10 a.m. UK time. When you do get to the post, scroll to the bottom of the post, hit post a comment, fill in your answers, leave me your name and a message and a social media link, tell us about your day and what you're planning to do. That would be nice. And then, once you've done all that, hit publish. Come back tomorrow after 10am, you can find out what the right answers are and how you've done, and if you're feeling really brave, you can have another go. Please feel free to like, share, and maybe put a tip in my tip jar. And please, have a very, very good day.